my family has experienced suicide. And like this was before I was born. Um, my my, uh, my parents had had a boy who unfortunately took his life at a very young age. And uh, my, my family has been like broken ever since. There hasn't been a closure to anything. And I feel like uh, my family is just one of the many, many families out there that hasn't put closure to uh, their loved ones because it's just too hard for them to do it. Because uh, you know, suicide is a very, very common thing up here. Our government is taking no form of uh, like ownership for literally all of Nunavut's history. Everything is connected. Like nutrition is connected to mental health. Um, residential schools are connected to mental health. Uh, like the dog slaughter is connected to mental health overcrowded families with a pandemic going on is also can be very stressful. There's a lack of almost everything here in Nunavut. We're now in 2021, going to 2022 next month. And now we still face the same common death, suicide. Uh, we, we're wondering why Canada is not doing anything to improve that. Um, their own people are dying from suicide and they're not taking knowledge of that. 